Look at this stuff. We don't have stuff like this at home. Then take it home. Maybe we can sell it. I mean, like this. What, what do they even do with this? Jesus. What the hell are you wearing? This is an earthling ceremonial gown. It signifies riches, royalty, and I don't know. I found it hanging in the closet next to a bunch of other shit. Check this out. Makes me look smart, doesn't it? It makes you look like a goddamn idiot. Well, you know what I say. When on Cravax, do as the Cravaxians. Do the Cravaxians look like a bunch of goddamn idiots? It's called appropriation. Wouldn't it hurt you to appreciate a little local culture? Like, what do you think this does? Unless that thing helps me fix the ship's particle fluctuator, I don't really give a shit what it does. You think our ship is safe out there? The cloaking mechanism is about the only thing that still works. I think I saw some locals creeping around out there. But if we don't get this fluctuator fixed soon, we're going to be stuck on this shithole planet! I mean, look at how primitive their tools are. It's not a tool, you jackass. It's an antique aura modulator. Just rub it right on your tempest like this. Oh man, that's the good stuff. Can't we just stay here for a little while? We've been out here for a long time. My girl's not gonna wait forever, you know. Your wife's a good woman, she'll wait. I'm not talking about my wife, I'm talking about my side chick. Besides, I'm getting seriously hungry. Hungry? You ate the two specimens when we got here. I don't know. I guess maybe the gravitational pull is messing with my metabolism? How about if I make you one of those hot cow slice sandwiches? I can't eat that shit. It's got gluten. Hippies like you are running this galaxy into the void. Look at the, how great this place is. Can you imagine living here among the Earth people? We could hunt with their tribes, celebrate their rituals, get sweet jobs like data entry specialists. Imagine if we made friends here. You don't know the first thing about making friends. Well, you know I know the first three things about making friends. After that, I'm a little sketchy on it. Look, I'm gonna get this particle fluctuator up and running and then we're out of here. Get that through your tempest. told you there was somebody creeping around out there. What do we do? We'll open it. We'll just tell them we're earthlings. But whatever you do, just be cool. What do you want? I'm James Maplewood from next door, and I saw some new faces over here, and I thought the best way to make friends is to whip up a batch of my famous brownies. I'd love to make friends. I cannot eat gluten. This is my uh, partner. You want to come in and make friends? And so before that, the Collins has lived here, and I don't really know them all that well. Um, I know they had a daughter, but she was sick, although that could have been a gossip. Um, but before that, there was this guy named Jerry. Jerry, um, Oh, I can't remember his last name. Uh, well, it was Jerry something. But he had this sweet Firebird that he was always working on. Oh, I wanted that car so bad. I wonder what happened to that guy. It was Jerry's, mm, Jerry something. 
So, uh, what do you guys do? We're running a cargo ship from Jinkazi 5 across the Roebuck Nebula down to the planet. We're in a band. That is so awesome! You know, I could bring some records over sometime and... Was that you again? Uh, that was your doorbell. Should I open it? That's usually the next step. Hello, sir. We're not interrupting anything, are we? No, not at all. My partner and I were just enjoying some of our new friend's famous brownies. Would you like to come in? Uh, I think there's been a mistake. Have a nice day, sir. I told you they weren't aliens. They're probably in a band or something. Where'd James go? What? Oh, him? He, uh, he left. God damn it, did you eat my friend? What was I supposed to do? I told you I can't have gluten. Man, he was a pretty cool dude. Am I ever going to make any friends here? Anything is possible. Oh man, that's the good stuff.